All right, guys, Georgia Jim. Again, this is my review of the Jimmy Long's pick roll as well as his new 15,000s picks. Uh, just to get started, I do have a working relationship with Jimmy where he does send me stuff for free often. Um, I did receive my 15,000s picks for free before everyone else got them. That way I could play with them and have an opinion on them. And <clears throat> I purchased the pick roll myself. Uh, and before... And also, before we get uh, going on the actual review, just to let everyone know, tomorrow, June 13th, Jimmy will have a product release. So keep an eye on his website. He's going to have some new profiles, and they're probably going to be in 15,000s too, if I'm not mistaken. But uh, if you haven't gotten Jimmy's, you know, here's an early uh, heads up. All right, so starting off with the picks, these are the exact same profiles as Jimmy's... Uh, other picks except in 15 thousandths and I would say that his 15 thousandths picks are actually stronger than some 20 thousandths picks from other competitors I won't name names but uh I definitely think these are stronger and just for a comparison this is a Jimmy Long's 15 thousandths prototype that I've been using for a very long time and we can see the refinements and the differences Jimmy's widen the shank and the shaft to make uh, increase the feedback increase the rigidity of the pick and I think the version 4 is honestly everything he's done in the new version 4 has exceeded my expectations and these were already jam up picks this uh, deep hook here I was one of my favorite picks for using like on challenge locks and deeper keyways and I have if you watch my order videos you can see that I've cranked on these picks and they're still holding up fine uh, he has a better tumbling process now. I'm not sure if the camera will pick it up, but his uh, picks are much smoother than they used to be, which they were already nice, but these are even better. Like here on the top, I could feel some roughness on the picks. Now they're just, everything's nice and smooth and well, very well tumbled. I did put some paint on mine to differentiate the 15,000s from the 18s, but some people are now 3D printing a little plug that will fit in the handle for easy identification. I've been using these on stuff like the Lockwood 334, 410 Lottos, uh, Ava 7240s, some of the G, uh, European stuff like Zeiss Icon uh, Vector Profiles, and the uh, GG AP 2000s, stuff like that, and they have been working great. Uh, getting on to the pick roll, this is a $9 pick roll sold by Jimmy. He got with US Peacekeeper who makes a tool roll for, or a tool roll sold on Amazon. And he got with them and collaborated. This holds, this has 12 pockets in it and I have 18 picks. I have his intermediate and beginner set in 18 thousandths here and all of his 15 thousandths over here. And the zippered pocket, I have a, uh, all of Jimmy's tensioners plus plenty more room to add even more. Um, and I'll be honest with you, for the $9 price tag on this, I really had very low expectations of its quality, and that has been blown away. Uh, especially even, you know, the fact that I paid for it, and I was like, well, I'm just gonna buy it so I can uh, see how good it is, and, you know, plus support Jimmy. But honestly, this is uh, very nice done. The stitching is well done, nothing feels cheap. The nylon is thin enough to easily move but i can push it the pick tips against it and it's not going to poke through the holes or it's not going to poke through and cause holes uh the nylon is thin enough to be very easily to roll and very very comfortable without being overly stiff or feel like i'm fighting the roll and everything rolls up very nice and tight the flap on top keeps everything secure so again for the nine dollars this is a very uh nice pick roll um, especially for something like Jimmy's with his handles, which makes a lot of times finding something to stick them in uh, a challenge because they don't, these thicker handles, they don't like things like the uh, the tuxedo case from Sparrows or the Covert Instruments uh, Garrison or uh, trade craft cases. Uh, those work much better with the smaller steel laminated uh, handles, but this is uh, very nicely done and uh, I've been nothing but impressed with it so far. Uh, again, 
make sure you guys check out Jimmy Long's. He will have his new release tomorrow on the 14th. So hope everybody can watch this uh, and go show Jimmy some love and check out his new profiles, especially in the 15,000s. All right, guys, thanks.